The current system of medicines regulation is a direct response to several well-known catastrophes that happened in the last century. In these, patients or their unborn children were harmed by the very medicines that were supposed to heal them. As a consequence, medicines regulatory agencies license medicines on the basis of data that prove the quality, the safety and the efficacy of each product. To ensure public health, regulatory agencies need to be assured of the efficacy, safety and quality of all medicines on an ongoing basis. To do this, they gather comprehensive data about all licensed medicines. These databases held by the agencies allow for rapid response in situations where the health of patients may be at risk. For example, in July 2019, tests revealed that certain well-known blood pressure and heart medications contained a cancer-causing impurity. When the safety concern was first identified, the regulatory agencies needed to determine at short notice the source of the contaminant and which products from which companies in which countries might be affected. Because they were able to do this from the data that they held, the drug companies were able to recall the affected products within a matter of days. The medicines information collected by regulatory agencies is made available to them by the pharmaceutical companies that market these products. Relevant data come from a wide variety of sources. These are manually uploaded into the regulatory databases by human experts. The volume and complexity of data requested by the agencies is continually increasing, and the collection, synthesis and upload of these data is a time-consuming and resource-intensive process. For this project, we developed a tool that uses natural language processing to extract relevant data from multiple different sources in multiple different languages about medicinal products of particular public health interest. The outcome is presented in a report format which is available for upload into regulatory databases worldwide. This removes the need for human re-entry of the same data into these multiple databases. The burden for industry is reduced and at the same time public health is promoted. The tool promotes sustainable development goals by ensuring healthy lives, contributing to the well-being of all at all ages and by increasing international cooperation. <music>